So here at Somerset College, we are based in the Western Cape, in the Helderberg region, which is a lovely area of, of the Western Cape and quite close to Cape Town and quite close to Cape Town International Airport, which makes it very handy and useful for our international students. In 2015, we started the Cambridge program here, which runs parallel to our local grade 11 and grade 12 years, so offering the AS and A2, which culminates in the international A-level for 17 and 18-year-old students. Somerset College is also a boarding school, and we offer boarding to both boys and girls, where we have 60 beds for boys and 60 beds for girls. Even though we are an IB school, and we run the Cambridge program, in parallel to the grade 11 and 12 years, we try and integrate our IEB students and the Cambridge students as much as possible. Any Cambridge student coming and joining us for the AS year would have the same opportunities as any IEB student that may have been here since the beginning of grade eight. This means that they can still put their names forward for leadership positions, they can still be prefects, they can still be heads of portfolio, they can still take part in sports, and cultural activities, they can be part of the jazz band, they can be part of our Pops concert. So a Cambridge student coming in, no matter where they're coming in from, can still take part and take advantage of all the opportunities offered here at Somerset College. As a Cambridge International School, we offer the Cambridge A-Level program as a two-year stage route. This means the students will follow the AS program in the first year, essentially our grade 11 year, and then doing the A2, in the second year, which is essentially our grade 12 or our matric year. So this allows our Cambridge students to get a full A-level qualification at the end of two years, which means that they get their full international A-level at the same time that they would have achieved their matric certification here in South Africa. The examinations that we write here are during the October-November series of examinations offered by Cambridge which means that our year starts in January and ends in November. Right, the subjects offered here at Somerset College are all about trying to make sure that our students have the correct subject choices for local universities, in other words, for universities close to us here in South Africa, where they have to follow the subject choices required by USAP. And we also try and make sure that our students have the correct subject combinations for international study. So in our AS year, students will do four or five subjects depending on what they've done prior to that, whether they have a grade 10 or an IGCSE for example. And in their second year, they can do three or four subjects at A level. And this then allows them to cover all the bases of either studying locally here in South Africa or going abroad with an international qualification. So as mentioned earlier, the Inle Somerset College program, the classes are a little bit smaller than what we have in IAB. We try and keep the class average to around about 14, 15 students per class and this allows a really good relationship to, to be formed between teachers and students and allows the students to ask questions and to be more engaged with the class and with the teacher and the subject matter. So behind me you'll see we have currently a further maths class running and the further maths class is obviously a smaller group of students. So what we have here is, is one of our teachers who is highly qualified in maths and has also lectured at university level. I love the teachers, they're very good at um, teaching and I found it very easy to uh, communicate with them and I also like the, the aspect of being close to them uh, because we do have smaller uh, classes so it's more personal and I think that really helped me uh, to uh, talk to them or ask questions. So the student body at Somerset College in the Cambridge program is made up largely of local students where we have students from our current grade 10 group but also from students in South African schools, currently in South African schools who have opted to join our Cambridge program here. A large percentage of our students also come from various countries around the world. I chose the Cambridge uh, system because before I came to uh, Somerset College, I used to study in England. And I was very used to the uh, Cambridge system doing GCSE and, and things like that. So when I came here, I was glad that they offered Cambridge because I, after doing grade 10, which was the IEB system, I 
figured that doing the Cambridge system fit me more than doing the IAB system. I'll say that since we started this Cambridge program, we have had a number of students who have placed first in the world in a number of top subjects such as mathematics and economics and English and Afrikaans. It is really pleasing to see these students go on to greater things at universities either here in South Africa or around the world. As a result of these excellent results that we've achieved over the years, we have a number of top students who are making application to come join us in the Cambridge program here. Here in the Somerset College Cambridge program, we have a saying that is, remember your why. This is because it is a challenging program for our students as they write exams at the end of the first year and the second year. So it is an accelerated program. And going forward into university, it's going to make it so much easier. Uh, once uh, Mr. Tucker once told us that it's not about getting in university, it's about getting through university. And Cambridge really propelled you. How are we going to help students achieve this is by having experienced teachers, a solid program that has been running for eight years, and a vast knowledge of what is required in the Cambridge curriculum. This means that at Somerset College we have all the tools in place to help students remember their why and to achieve their goals. We have the best teachers that are experienced in Cambridge and in teaching the way it should be taught 